Okay, where was I? Cutting up and down into four inch squares. Today on Crafty Circle, we'll be cutting up denim squares. That's right. These denim squares would be great around the house. You can use them for everything. Cleaning up messes, making yourself little quilts, napkin holders. Denim squares are fantastic. Or, come out to the shop, we'll cut up some denim with razor blades. Okay, so I'm guessing that if I put aluminum foil in here, and that'll make releasing the mold a little easier. I don't have really much experience with epoxy, with um, gluing denim, um, or not. I mean, I definitely could look this up on the internet, but uh, I'm not in the shop, and I'm, I'm going to stay out here for a little while. The instructions say to mix it for a minute. Uh, I'm not doing that. But I am going to mix it together. And then I guess I'll just start laying in my squares. Alright, so um, things to note. Uh, aluminum foil is not a release for epoxy uh, at all. And uh, if you stick a piece of wood on top to push down, it's going to get stuck to it. Because that's what epoxy is for. And it looks like that will leave just enough material for the outside. bracelets before so I've got this jam chuck that I've already got made up for it feels really soft. <laughs> it's interesting. It's hard because it's epoxy. But you can actually feel the gene. And it's really soft. It's like, I don't, it's really weird. It's really cool. Blue jean bracelet. Pretty cool, right? Take an old pair of jeans and turn it into something useful. And actually, quite pretty. Here it is. It's unfinished because I really like the fact that you can still feel the material. It's hard, but it still feels like it's still soft. It's just, I don't, I don't know how it works. It's a mystery. And I've got my super secret list of upcoming projects. Copper pipe box. Check. Denim bracelet. Check. Oh, yeah, see, there's no way you can possibly see it because I'm not filming in high def. Sorry about that. I have still been working on the colored pencil rings. Here is attempt number four. Here is attempt number five. Here is attempt number six. I got pretty close with six. <sighs> and then here's all the other parts that, I don't know. I'm trying everything I can. I honestly am. I'm running out of ideas. If I can't get it right, I'm just, I'm not going to be able to sell them. It's just, I just wouldn't feel right putting it up there. For, um, as a flimsy piece of garbage. Uh, I'd like to give a shout out to Pocket83. His projects are always just 
weird, interesting. Oh look, that's an idea I'd like to try. I would definitely recommend looking him up. So that's what I've got going on, and hopefully I'll have something unusual, original, new next week. Thank you as always for watching, and please subscribe. Thanks.